Normal people say what they mean. They want something, they ask. Screwed up people never say what they mean. But if you grow up among them, you learn their ways, their customs, their drinking habits. <laughs> Until one day you become known as the translator. <laughs> May I have the remote? <laughs> I am currently using the remote. It's ironic you're watching synchronized swimming when your girlfriend drowned last month. <laughs> All right. Go, Niners! Next time, just give me the remote. When you can't communicate, you act out. It's called acting out. <laughs> and when you act out above a freeway exit ramp, it's called violating the penal code. <laughs> when Dave and I were teenagers, had we seen a sign that said penal code? <laughs> We'd have stolen that too. Hey, hey, after this one, we'll get dangerous curves. Uh -huh. And then slippery when wet. Uh -huh. They arrested us, put us in jail. Four hours later, Dad brought bail. He took us home, put us on the line. We did hard time, hard time. Dad, we're finished. Nice job, boys, but you missed a spot. <laughs> After that, I decided Dad would only humiliate me for two more years. Three years later, I was on my own. Dave still lives with Dad because he doesn't have my spontaneity. Uh, excuse me, Christopher Titus, uh, my brother's been arrested. Who's your brother? You must be new here. See? This is my other son, Christopher. He doesn't have as many felonies as his brother. Now, can you believe, Dave? I wasn't surprised. Oh, man, what do you do this time? Grand theft. Grand theft? That's a real crime. And this is a real police station. <laughs> and your brother is a real criminal. Well, Dad, if you were bailing him out, why did you call me? Well, me bailing him out is against the rules. I had him arrested. What? 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 You... You, you, California Public Schools. Why did you have him arrested? He knows what he did. Ask him. Okay, fine. Dave, he had you arrested? What did you do? He can't hear you. Dave. <laughs> Isn't that sweet? Two brothers joined at the wussy. Mr. Titus, I need you to fill this out. Huh? Look at me, I'm fighting crime. <laughs> Excuse me, can you get a message to my brother in there? Sure, what do you want me to tell him? Um, tell him to not worry that uh, his big brother's here, and no matter what he did, I'll help him out of it. Don't worry, your big brother's here. No matter what you did, he's going to help you out of it. Thank you. You're welcome. Dave, can you hear me? Oh, so what happened? Dave. 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 If you can hear me, I can hear you, moron. I heard that. Hey, Titus, I found a space. Can I have a quarter for the meter? Yellow Subaru? Yeah. Too late. Oh! This is all Dave's fault. What is it this time? They find his marijuana plants? <laughs> You smoke a little pot at school, you get suspended. You make pot into a non-fat, creamy sandwich spread, 
you become an honor student. So I'm graduating, right? Valedictorian. <laughs> and we'd like you to come back next year as a teacher. Girls volleyball coach? Why not? <laughs> California Public School. Dave, what the hell happened? Dad went nuts when he found out I moved out and had me arrested for stealing my own stuff. It's my VCR. Uh, uh, officer, officer, look, this is ridiculous. That's his son in there. Just let him out. You are destroying a loving family. <laughs> Thank you, Tommy. That was a tension breaker. <laughs> look, we can't release him unless your father drops the charges. Dad? Does the perpetrator have any recognizable scars? <laughs> Only emotional. There's no box for that. I'll just check other. <laughs> now what are you going to do? <laughs> Christopher, let me try. Mr. Titus, now this is something my father taught me. Father and son start together. And then they grow apart until the son's ready to be a man. And then they grow together again. <laughs> Can you get him away from me? You know, this, this can't just be about a VCR. What else did you do? I was just moving out. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah, well, Titus told me not to tell you. What? You? You? Yeah. I said don't tell Dad. But I also said, don't tell Dad I told you not to tell Dad. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> the only way to tell my dad your plans is to write him a note and tie that to a brick, then throw it through his window. Of course. Now Dad's armed with a brick. We're leaving, Ken. I've had it. Fine, I'm sure a 40-year-old woman with big hips and two kids won't have any trouble finding another husband. <laughs> Welcome home. Go buy yourself something sexy. So this is your fault. You told Dave not to tell him. Because all he does is mess with people's minds. You're right, I do. So you're doing it right now? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. All right, I am. Stop it! Stop what? <laughs> Mr. Titus, will you drop the charges if Dave gives you back the VCR? No, he needs to learn a lesson. Hey, Stevie Jr., where's your dad? Isn't he working tonight? He's in rehab. Rehab? Will you tell him from me that Ken Titus said he's a wussy? <laughs> I just don't get why he's so pissed. I moved out exactly the same way, and I stole his tools. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. What? You're the person he's trying to teach a lesson to. Me? Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> Tommy was a psych major for a year. Six years of college, he had seven majors. Psychology, English Lit, Economics. You're a clown college in Sarasota. But... His career was cut short when he lost his baby toe in a nasty shoe explosion. Kids, want to see my dipsy doodle dance? using Dave to get back at you for all the years of trouble that you cost him. I never did anything to him. Oh. And second, he started it. Oh, really? <laughs> the, the, the third time he got back together with his fourth wife, you didn't come to the party. She smelled like feet. All right. <laughs> oh, you blew the transmission out on his TR3. It was a stick. I was nine. Did you ever do that to one of your cars? No, I learned when I was nine. Well, she set fire to his boat. I was giving a Viking funeral to G.I. Joe. Did you ever set fire to your boat or your car? Uh -huh, right, uh -huh, right, uh -huh. right, all right, all right. Got it, you nine toed clown. <laughs> I've always tried to prove something to my father that I was smart, that I was talented, that I was his kid. Where the hell are you going? I'm 17. That's where the hell I'm going. I'm a man. I don't need you anymore, Dad. I mean, 
Ken. <laughs> so why don't you take a good look at that, old man? Because that's all you're going to be seeing of me for a while. <laughs> Four months, two weeks, six days, and nine hours later. <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> My key doesn't work in the door anymore. <laughs> I have laundry. <laughs> laundry? Here's some soap. <laughs> Find a rock in a river. <laughs> you push his buttons as much as he pushes yours. Uh, Tommy, I got it. I got it. Where the hell is Billy and Joey and Dan? Well, Billy retired and Joey retired and Dan blew his brains out. Retired? <laughs> They're my age. <laughs> Dad. Hey, listen, you want to go over to Mulaney's? I'm on duty, Mr. Titus. Oh, come on. That never stopped your father. <laughs> listen to him, Titus. All his buddies have retired. He's just so sad. When did cops forget how to party? <laughs> Dad, uh, they didn't forget how to party. They just don't party with someone your age. My age? Yeah. Look, look, I know what's going on here. You're old and you're panicking that you've lost control of Dave and me. Lost control? Thank you for facing that. And you took control. Well, it's like you taught us, Dad. I mean, that's how I got Dave to move out without telling you. Oh, so this is completely your idea. Well, sometimes you got to take action like you always taught us. I mean, you know, I drove the truck over. I helped him load it. I mean, that's, that's how I got him out of there. Yeah. You hear that, Steve? My son helped him load the truck. I heard it. You know what that means? You made me a man. But you made you an accessory. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent. Oops, too late. Don Fox! Accessory my ass, you evil son of... All I'm trying to do is help my brother, because you can't help eat him, vampire. Sucking all the life out of my soul, you sucking jerk. <laughs> Mr. Titus, I think having Christopher arrested is acting out in a way that's just plain unhealthy. I disagree. I had a headache before, but now it's gone. Excuse me, officer. I'm looking for Christopher... Titus' family reunion. It's right over there. Who the hell called her? <laughs> I don't know. I have to check my car. Come here. You got my message. Thank God. One night a week. I just want one night a week for myself. And look, I got it. Take a bath, go shopping, get an herbal wrap, go to the ATM so I can pick up bail money so I can get my boyfriend out of jail. And you know what? I'm refreshed. I feel like a mountain spring. You do smell fresh. Oh, thank you. They're towing your car. Oh, my God. He's lying. Erin has a special relationship with my father. She makes it possible for him and I to communicate. I mean, without her, I'd be talking about him instead of to him. Thanks, honey. Nice. I want you to hug each other. No. Christopher, you love your father. He's taught you everything that you know. Ew, Aaron, please. Papa Titus, you're proud of your son. Everything he does is a reflection of your love. Stop it. Your father is your life. Uh, it burns. Your son is the jewel of your eye. How long did you do this? All night. She's a witch. I'll stop uh, it, you hug. Uh, oh, now you feel better. You see the power of love between uh, us. Yeah. Titus, I know that the love that you feel... All right, all right, all right, I'll drop the charges. But you hug it. Release the idiot. Oh, that's great. You're doing the right thing. Ugh. Witch. <laughs> Thanks, baby. Yeah. All right, thank her, not me. Oh, thank you for what? Locking me up like a common criminal? You know, I had to turn around, sue your ass for false arrest. Dave, please listen to your inside voice right now. <laughs> What's it saying? You know, shut the hell up and get your stuff. Well, my inside voice is rude. 
Dad, I know it's going to give you a tumor, but you did the right thing. Yeah, okay, fine. Screw it. That's the spirit. Titus, <laughs> you need to fill out a release form? Sure, I got nothing better to do. Hey, listen, you, you guys want to go over to Mulaney's? Maybe uh, order a pizza or rent a videotape? Yeah, that'll be fun. We can reminisce about the time you threw your boys in jail. How long are you going to throw that in my face? <laughs> Us. Oh my God! With Dave gone, your dad'll spend more time with us. Hi, Dad. What a surprise! Join us. Nice pajamas. Go save yourself, Dad. Go talk to Dave. What do I say to him? Just get him to move back in with him. I just got him to move out. Well, just be honest with him. Honesty? But it is not the way of my people. <laughs> uh, Dave. What? Dad's dying. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. What? what? Uh, Aaron found out. Oh, my God. What is it? Uh, he's, got, he's got a heart thing. <laughs> the ticker? Yeah. <sighs> But those pig valves aren't even a year old. Dave, think. If you have a bad heart, you're not even supposed to eat pork. So how long does he have? Could be hours, could be years. With these things, you never know. That's why he had Dave arrested. Because he's lonely. He needs help. He's just too proud to ask. Hey, that's good. I mean, right. Yeah. Uh, Tommy, Tommy yeah. you know, he is dying, so... Oh, yeah. I, I got it. So, so don't tell Dad that you know. And don't tell Dad that I told you not to tell Dad. And remember that this time. Man, poor Dad. I'm going to be there for him. Good. Every Sunday. No, 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 no. See, if you check on him, then he'll know you know. So if you really want to fool him, move back in. Yeah, and he's gonna need help, Dave. You know, taking showers, going to the bathroom, cleaning himself. Tommy, 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 Tommy. He's not that sick. Oh, okay. Tommy, and, and you. Oh, with the shh and the hard thing. I, I know. <laughs> he, he's not that sick. <laughs> I mean, he just needs some company, you know, um, someone around to, uh, to answer the phone when you need to call 911. You know? <laughs> nope, not worth it. Hey, hey. Dave, I'll, I'll, t I'll tell you what. You do this for Dad. <sighs> I'll buy you guys a new VCR. No, no. Dad doesn't watch videotapes anymore. He likes that DVD thing. Okay, DVD player. <laughs> No, then Dad will just get mad about how cruddy the DVD picture looks on the crappy old TV, you know. I, I don't want to upset him, you know, because of his ticker. DVD player, new TV. You know, the cable in our neighborhood really sucks. Dad would like a satellite. Uh, D you know what? Dad will be dead before I buy you a satellite. <laughs> Deal. Dad dies, I get satellite dish. <laughs> Deal. So I have something to remember him by. Yeah. Papa Titus, I know the love that you have. All right, all right, all right, all right. He can move back in. He's painting my ass. <laughs> Slow, slow. Will somebody keep him away from me? So, Dad? Yeah? So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. 
This is great. They're talking. Not quite. So, you admit to being a wussy for sneaking out and stealing my stuff. It was daylight. It was my piece of crap VCR. Now they're talking. All right. I cannot believe that I brought up such an idiot and a loser. The house will feel so empty without you there, son. <laughs> You were always riding my ass and, and calling me a wussy. <laughs> You've made me a stronger, better person. That's because you are a wussy. You're everything I'd always hoped you'd be. <laughs> you, you need your ass kicked, old man. I love you, Daddy. If you don't shut up, I will shut you up. It's so beautiful. <laughs> I can't... <laughs> rather rip out my eyeballs with rusty screwdrivers than live with you. All right, all right. You could move back in, but it's going to cost you a hundred bucks a month. Fine, fine. But I want my room painted. Agreed. You buy the paint and you paint it. You watch me. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Titus. Oh. Are you sure this is your VCR? Damn straight. We found half an ounce of marijuana in it. <laughs> Yeah, that's his piece of crap VCR. But the pot is mine. <laughs> Normal people say what they mean. My dad's a pain in the ass. My girlfriend's constantly pissed at me. My brother's an idiot and Tommy annoys the crap out of me. Life is beautiful. I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. I'm the funny one. Okay, fine. Romance is one thing, but timing is everything. My parents are the A and P, so I only have like 15 minutes. That 70s show tomorrow at 8, 7 Central on Fox. Experience. Ah! Puberty hit you like a ton of bricks. The rat. They're just like boils. The plague stopped visit them upon Egypt. Oh, my God. The water, it turns all red and goopy. How delightful. It's as if someone stabbed Mr. Bubble. An epic new family guy. God is ticked. Tomorrow at 8.30.